Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coke taste, zero calories. Enjoy everything. Bush has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep to open up the ball game. Here we go, folks. He'll return it from the four-yard line. And he's taken down at the 23. Anderson's a guy you really have to game plan for if you're a defensive coach. And we sat down with the coaches this week, and they know, they look at him, they look at that offensive line, and they know they're in for a long day. Well, it's going to be a tough challenge for this defense. One thing that they, I think, have to do is commit numbers to the line of scrimmage. They've got to be willing to take chances, put an eighth, sometimes ninth guy up close to the line of scrimmage and force his quarterback to try to have to beat them by throwing the ball through the air. Otherwise, it could be a long day for this defense. It's second down now, 13 to go. Ball on the 20. Now he tries to buy some time. And he's taken down around the 25-yard line. Good coverage by the defense, but they have to be aware of this quarterback's tendency to scramble around and pick up some yards. complete he's got space to work tackle made at the 34 yard line tight ends can really be a wild card in any offense sometimes the defense are a little bit confused on how to handle them first and ten ball on their own 34 tackle right around the 36 yard line that's good to be two yards that makes it second and eight throw and he's got the tight end again he's taken down around the 49 yard line nice pickup as they connect on the pass play but they look to be in sync right now they're both reading the defense properly and the result is a nice game from their own 49 yard line first down he makes it out to midfield Now he's scrambling, and they got him. I think this defensive end is doing a great job of getting after the quarterback, not only with the sack in this case, but it seems like the entire game he's done a good job of creating pressure, making this quarterback feel him, and almost giving him happy feet back there where he doesn't seem to be in rhythm and almost seems to be throwing the football, feeling the, the pressure and almost creating nerves on the quarterback. Pass to the tight end, but he bottles the ball away. Burns was the intended receiver on that pass. They couldn't pick up the first down, so they'll have to punt this one away. It was a good hold by the defense on third down. Now their punt returner will get a chance to make something happen. Haley fields it at the 19, and he's tackled at the 25. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. There's a strike complete, and he's tackled at the 31-yard line. Good for a gain of six yards. That brings him second and five. From their own 31-yard line, second down. Throws incomplete, intended for his wideout. This is a well-designed play by the offensive coordinator. Everything really seemed to be working just fine, except for the quarterback. He's got to throw a better football. Looks to the back and can't connect. Number 20, the intended receiver on the play. That'll bring up fourth and five. Botano is back to receive. Yes, yes, yes. 
He's taken down at the 42. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Pitches back. Gains his way to the 36-yard line. That's a nice job by the quarterback to pitch the ball. And it got him a first down. From the 36-yard line, it's first down. Got it complete. He's out of bounds. You know, I've talked to so many college quarterbacks who have gone on to be very successful in the NFL, and they all talk about the execution of the play action. And all of them talk about the good ones, about taking their time and really working to sell the play action and sell the fake. If you don't take the time as a quarterback to really sell the fake, it's going to make it easy on the linebackers and safeties to realize that that was just a fake handoff and to get back in position. But when you really work it and sell it the way that quarterback did right there, that's when it's more effective. It can open up the big play. From the 21-yard line, it's second down. He's on the run. They'll bring him down at the 21. Fires out quickly to the tailback. And down he goes at about the 17-yard line. They pick up at the most four yards on the screenplay. It's fourth down. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. Trying to take the lead by a field goal. It's up, and it is good. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Fielded at the four. They'll bring him down at the 30-yard line. And while they are behind, they know they can knock things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. Throws it. Watch out. Oh, almost had a pick. You know, for a safety, this guy has really good hands. I'm very surprised to see him drop an interception like that. Could come back to haunt his team as well. On the throw, incomplete pass. From their own 30-yard line, third down. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Brought down at the 44. Strike to his receiver, no good. That makes it second. From their own 44 yard line, second down. Fires out to his receiver. He goes out of bounds at midfield. Nothing flashy at all, but now that first down marker is a lot closer. his way to about the 42. That's good for the media box. First down. From the 42 yard line. First down. An exciting first quarter comes to an end. 3-0.
Longhorn. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. He fights forward to about the 39. From the 39-yard line, it's second down. There's a very impressive open field tackle. It's the ninth play of the drive. Scrambling around. And now he's going to improvise. This is a pretty tough guy, and he's a great leader. He's going to do whatever it takes to help his team. From the 15-yard line, first down. Laterals back. Gets to about the 14-yard line. This is the 11th play of the current drive. Pulls it in and he's in the open field. They've looked good so far on third down on this drive. Let's see what happens here. the three-yard line. Well, they're living on the edge here a little bit, but, you know, they're converting when they have to. This is the 13th play of this drive. It's power against power right now on the field. Both teams have their jumbo sets out there. Fagan takes it left. Touchdown! Splits the uprights with the extra point. A 13-play, 70-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. Bush has his kick team lined up, and he is set to kick this one off. He'll return it from the four-yard line. He gets out to about the 28-yard line. Flag down, and I'm not sure when it was thrown. Let's find out. Receiving team. That's frustrating for a coach when you preach fundamentals every week and then have someone called for clipping. That penalty really is going to set them back. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Tries to get around the corner. He gets to about the 24-yard line. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. Play action here. He's going to scramble. And he's sacked. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. So it's third down now, and they're going to need about four. He's scrambling, and they make the stop around the 24-yard line. That's a deep four. That makes it fourth and inches. Barnes awaits the snap. <laughs> Haley takes it at the 43, brought down at the 50. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Go. 
Fires to the wideout. First down. From the 36-yard line, it's first down. And he's taken down at the 26-yard line. Here they go on the draw and they'll lose yards. That makes it second and ten. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 26-yard line. down immediately. That'll make it third and five. Catch there before he stepped out of bounds. That's a deal of 12 on the play. That makes it first and goal. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. just outside the goal line. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. They bring him down in the backfield. Did you see how quickly he was able to get into the backfield and make that tackle? Not many guys that big can move that fast. And this is the eighth play of the drive. quickly and he's got his receiver for the touchdown and he hits the PAT an eight play 50 yard drive and they come away with seven points you know Brad a lot of times you have to watch practice and watch a seven on seven drill to not see the ball touch the ground but this time they went the entire length of the field the ball never touched the ground great execution by the quarterback and the receiver so the score now 14 three and he's taken down at the 24 the Longhorns know I think that at some point they just have to do what they do even if it's not working right now if they can get it going in the second half it should really improve the ball game and the offense. Well, the offensive line, I think, also has to be accountable here. Uh, we look so much to our star players, and we always want them to put up big numbers. But to me, the two go hand in hand. When a running back's going to have a great game, the offensive line deserves some credit. When a running back's struggling, you got to look at that offensive line and say, fellas, you got to help me out. We're not going to change or deviate from this game plan. We need to be able to change this game around, and it starts up front with the offensive line. He scrambled. Man left, man left. Third down and 11 coming up here. Ball on their own 23. And he hits him hard at the 25 yard line. As they head to the locker rooms, this one is far from over. 14 3. we played 30 minutes. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. David Pollock and I here in the studio to break down everything that just happened in your game. So far, so good for both offenses in terms of taking care of the football, but now the defenses are ramping up the sense of urgency in terms of trying to get the ball back to their offense. Uh, absolutely. you got to find Reese. These ball hawks on defense, they need to find the football. They need to make some big plays, create some turnovers. How about using that hit stick a little bit? How about knocking somebody silly and making them drop the football? I mean, 
defense's number one priority is trying to turn the football over, try to make a big explosive play for your offense so, so they can do more damage and they can take the ball down the field. So those ball hawks need to show themselves in the second half. David's ready to get back on that couch, get the remote, get all the games dialed up to watch what's going on around the country. It's time to get you back for your second half. Brad and Kirk, ready to roll. All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. He'll take it from the two. Tackle at the 26. Here comes the offense as they look to find the end zone yet again. to his receiver. He's taken down at about the 35. They pick up good yardage that time on the pass play. Here they kind of put pressure on the quarterback and challenged him to find the hole in the defense. And in this case, he did. Nice job. Short yardage situation here. Second down and one. Quick throw out to the receiver. Incomplete. Quick to the receiver, and it falls incomplete. Maxwell was intended to receive on the play. Fourth down. Wiggins is waiting for the snap. <laughs> no. Fields at the 29. Makes it out to maybe the 40-yard line. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. And he's tackled the 47-yard line. From the 47-yard line, first down. throw got him anywhere he gets hit out of bounds around the 29 yard line when you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that you've got the defense right where you want it first and ten ball of the 29 The ball carrier taken down as he works the left for a nice game. That brings him second and five. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Steps up into the pocket and they've got him. down and they need to get it to the 19. Quick throw incomplete one of his receiver. Thompson's intended receiver right away. That'll make it fourth and ten. around the 22-yard line. And they're going to have to give the ball back after going for it on fourth and long. Not much you can do there. you got to go for it and give yourselves a chance. Nine times out of ten, the defense will make a stop on that play. But, you know, based on the situation, this offense did have to go for it. Their last drive ended in a punch, so this quarterback's going to be looking for something better on this drive. He's out to the 30, and it's caught. I'm really liking what I see from this guy. He's not afraid to go to the air on any down. First down, 10 yards to go. 
Ball on the 36 yard line. And down he goes at the 37. That's a good for a gain of one yard. That brings up second and nine. Throws incomplete. This is a well-designed play by the offensive coordinator. Everything really seemed to be working just fine, except for the quarterback. He's got to throw a better football. From their own 37-yard line, it's third down. Looks over the middle, caught by the tailback. They'll bring him down at about the 49. I'm not sure if the back was his first option, but he got in the ball, and he was able to make something big happen. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. Gain of 10 on that play. That makes it first and 10. From the 39-yard line, first down. Fires across the middle. Brought down at about the 21. First down. complete he's got room to work how about the big fellows up front this line will have to continue to play like that to build the consistency to help this offense be effective and this play is number eight on the drive and they get him in the backfield for a loss the object was to sell the pass and then sneak by the defensive line with the run the problem here was that the quarterback didn't sell the pass very well it's second and goal. Ball on the 10. And he throws it away. And this is the 10th play of the drive. And he tackles him hard at the 18. Fourth and goal. It's fourth down. So the field goal unit is on the field. They'll try for three points. The kick is up, and he got it. Everyone's all and ready for the kickoff. Fielded at the four. They'll bring him down at the 34. You know, this defense played so well in the first half. I was very impressed. I know that, and I couldn't be more impressed with how they carried it over to the third quarter. Well, the most impressive thing is the way they have been able to maintain that into this second half. They played lights out in the first half, but they just seem to be getting better as this game goes on. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. He zips it out to the left. That's incomplete. Well, that was clearly a poor read on somebody's part. And the bad news is there was no defender around. If the pass was anywhere near him, it could have gone for a big play. Second and 10. Ball on the 34. He's going left. That close to being intercepted. Davis was the intended receiver on the play. Third down. Looks middle, got his back. He's tackled at the 39 yard line. That'll make it fourth and six. Barnes to punt. Gets 
to about the 34-yard line. They're set to go for another round. Fires quick to an open man. He dropped it. From their own 34-yard line. Second down. Slings it, and he's level at the 49. He is such a reliable target. You throw it anywhere near him, and this guy's going to get his hands on it and make a catch. Makes the grab and steps out right away. It's not over yet, folks. We head to the fourth quarter. 17-3. We're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. Get to that quickly. You know what? After a play like that, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised if they went to the air again. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. He makes it out to maybe the 29-yard line. Throws it in a hurry. And they make the stop around the 23-yard line. Fagan picks up six yards with that grab. Man, that's another first down on this drive. They've looked really good since they came out on the field. From the 23-yard line, it's first down. He's on the run. He makes his way out to about the 12. This is the eighth play of this drive. And run up the gut. Call it a game of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. He's scrambling. Keeps it, and he's got a touchdown. Nice run there by that quarterback. Well, great decision by the quarterback reading the defense, and as soon as he saw the open field, he cut it upfield and scored the touchdown. And he converts the extra point. A nine-play, 65-yard drive, and they add seven points to the scoreboard. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 31. Not much luck the last time this offense had the ball. Scrambling around, and they got him. That makes four sacks today. Well, this speed is difficult to defend because you have to try to keep them off balance so they can't use their quickness. Second down and 12. Ball on the 28. The 
scoops it up. That's a great tackle at the 38-yard line. And that's exactly what this defense was looking for. Yeah, that fumble gives these guys some added life. Now let's see if they can capitalize off of it. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Less than three minutes in the game. And they get nice yardage on that run. That makes it second and six. From the 34-yard line, it's second down. And he's taken down at the 19-yard line. He kept it himself and picked up a good-looking first down. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. Inside give, tackle made around the 19-yard line. It's second and 10. Ball on the 19-yard line. They'll keep it on the ground again. And they push him out at the four-yard line. William, we want to get out of here. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Bush gets set to kick this one away. No, from the four. Oh, man, did he take a hit. Kirby, this is kind of fun to watch. You don't usually give defenses credit for a win, but that's what's going to happen. Here. Now, we're in an era of college football where it's always about the offense or the quarterback. This has been fun to watch a game where the defense has really asserted itself, and they've been the reason that this team has the lead. Under a minute left. Throws to the tailback, incomplete. From their own 30-yard line. Second down. And two, four, it's three, four, and three. Wide out makes the first down catch. That one goes for good yardage and a first down. Yeah, that's just a nice gain on second down. So they're going to try to determine if the receiver had possession and was inbounds or not. They call it a catch, but the booth signaled down to the referee that they'd like to take another peek at this. Man, as I see this play again, it really looks like he made the correct call on the field. After review the play, the ruling, the ruling on, the on the field stands. stands. Well, I think the play warranted a review, but the call on the field stands. From their own 41-yard line, first down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Complete. He's got room. And he's tackled around the 49-yard line. I'll tell you something. I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. Under heavy pressure. There's a strike complete. He's down. Thompson picks up about five yards on that hookup. From the 44-yard line. Second down. He's 
taken down at the 36 yard line. Five wide. He's got it with room to run. He gets hit out of bounds around the 26 yard line. It's second down, and they're about the length of the football from the first down marker. And he just gets rid of it. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Passes it to the middle of the field. Right around the 10 yard line. From the 10 yard line, first down. And he's going to be sacked. going to do it for this one. Our final score, 31-3. Thanks for joining us for another game of NCAA Football 14. For Kurt and everyone here at EA Sports, Brad Nussler saying goodbye, and we'll see you next time.